Yay, glitches. Those are always fun to deal with. <laughs> so, you know who I am. I am Jester Rama. Hello and welcome, buggies. And why can I barely hear myself? Oh, that's a lot better. Okie dokie. So, you know what we're gonna do. I announced it just ahead of time, saying hello. Secret of Mana, let's continue. So, you might notice the chat's a little bit bigger with the text. So, this is a way of legibility being more, being better. So that when people are viewing on mobile, they can see what's said more easily. Let me know if this is too large for you. <laughs> and don't take that the wrong way. Rhythm, I'm looking at you. <laughs> So, I need to do the usual little introduction of saying what to do and support for this stream and channel. If you want to be constantly up to date, or nearly always up to date, you can always go to the Bug Hive at this little, little link thingy right up above me. It says fa 7 me Meh. Mm, meh. It's, it is, it's, it's my server, yeah, but it's your server too. We kind of share the place so we can all have some fun and be open and understanding and be inclusive. I mean, that's what I want to try and do. But if you're already in the bug hive and a buggy, uh, you can also be a subscribe buggy by subscribing to Twitch. And it is September, as a lot of the Twitch streamers are saying, for the last portion of the month, the subscriptions are still half off. But if you don't want to do the Twitch route and want to provide a higher cut for your support to me, you can subscribe to my Patreon or GameWisp down below. If you subscribe to my Patreon at $1, you get, of course, a great thank you because you're freaking awesome for supporting me. For $5... You get your name in the credits right down there for as long as you are subscribed. And I do give you a grace period in case you need to, well, get yourself better supported. Because I am not going to be taking all of your money. You are one with a budget and free will. So as long as you spend responsibly, that's okay. Ow, I hit my hand on the desk. <clears throat> Anyways, the other benefit of Patreon currently, and yeah, my Patreon is a little bit less than Game Wisp. On Patreon, if you spend $5 in support, you get your name in the credits, and you get free music whenever I make music, but I haven't really made that much music lately. So, you might not want to directly go with Patreon unless you really want to. I mean, Patreon gets the most out of, gives me the most of the cut, but second, you would have GameWisp, which is a more Twitch gaming gamer YouTuber uh, streamer, basically whatever gaming type of Patreon. Now, unfortunately, I didn't see an option for $1, but also there's a few more fees that I have to eat for, um, unfortunately, costs, taxes, and just general fees. But in GameWisp, you get a Twitter shout-out, a follow on Twitch, and, of course, your name is in the credits, and... You know, if Patreon doesn't work out, I might go with Game Wisp, but Patreon gives me better support for what you're contributing. So, eh, I don't know. But yeah, I think that's about it. Um, oh, right, this, these little series of dashes going across right here. This should work this time. Uh, if you cheer by giving me bits that you have to get on PC first... Uh, I found out you can get, you can send bits on mobile, but you have to have done it on, you had to have, you've had to bought bits ahead of time on your PC. And I did notice it's not exactly, a thousand bits is ten dollars to me, but it's not ten dollars to you. So I do want to say for the amount of money you are contributing to get just like a thousand bits, thank you for going that far. You are freaking awesome. And our top cheer right now is Iridus1 with a thousand bits from the last stream. And and now, since the session's restarted or whatever, you should show up right down here with your name, well, your username, the money you sent, and a message. I think I incorporated a message. Oh, that reminds me. I need to actually turn on stream labels. 
in order for this to probably work correctly. Stream, label, stream labels is software that I use. It's a little quick software that uses text files or makes text files that will be what instantly update for bits, tips, and subs. Yeah, pointing somewhere, somewhere, yeah. And it thing that you do for bits also applies to tips. So if you spend a minimum of a dollar because Streamlabs requires a minimum of a dollar, you get your name, amount, and message down at that little tips thing right over there. Oh, there we go. My hand looks longer now. I was going like this. My hand looks so short. My hand's not stubby. No, it's not. It's nice and strong. It's expressive, too, as you can see. And I'm wasting plenty of time with this introduction, but... Hey, it's an introduction. I need to do this, especially if you're new. I am Jesse D. I am crazy free. So yes, that is about everything for the introduction. So we'll be doing a game thing now. And Rhythm, yes, I will do a Halloween stream. And I need to check the calendar for that because I might be working that day. All right, let's see. Tuesday. Tuesday is perfect. It might actually be a doctor day, because I'm going to try and be the doctor more on Tuesdays. Doctor Tuesday. That's why I said it. That's why I made it that. So, I should be able to do a Halloween stream. Excuse you, Mega Spider. I'm not stubby. I'm six feet tall. Although I am kind of stocky for a six foot tall guy. I look kind of shorter than I actually am. I'm just a strong bug, you don't you know? Anyways... I will be doing more streaming if I can, and it's, I think, I haven't really been doing much streaming to begin with because I've had anxiety and depression to deal with and I don't always have the will to stream, but I always want to commit to saying, I want to do a stream weekly at least once because I have fun doing it, I have fun sharing games, I have fun playing games. So, speaking of the games, I need to open up ZSNES in order to get ourselves Acclimated for Secret of Mana. Yeah. Let's see if it works. Come on, ZSNES, work with me. Okay. Now show up and stream. Come on, ZSNES, you gotta be working. Damn it. Damn it. You know what? I need to do this. Do the, I need to do the display capture. Because window capture doesn't work. It's a different little thing that, I don't know, for whatever reason in programming, it doesn't want to show up. So, oh, both game capture and display capture are off. Let me check this again. So, pardon my prof lack of professionalism, but I've never been 100% professional because I want to still have fun too. And I mean, you can have fun as a professional, yeah, but I'm just a little bit more free form. Okay, yeah, that's not working. All right. Yeah, I told you. I'm so professional. So, let me just not turn a few things off. Get rid of my post-its. My scripts. Oh, I should probably remove that um, <clears throat> shortcut to something that's doing what a pirate is free to do. I can't support that in the stream, but you might know what I'm talking about. And... Come on. Hey, there we are. Desktop Ahoy. Monitor 1, or Monitor 2, technically. It's my main monitor because I always look at it because I want to be making it seem I am looking at the game. And I am. And the camera makes this reflect it perfectly. So when I look at you like this, you know I'm talking to you. When I'm like this... I'm playing a game. I don't always express all the time, but I have this here because it's flavor. I like flavor. So, as I fill the void with my talkativeness, I say, we should play Secret of Mana! Ah, the whale. Doesn't always sound like a whale, but close enough. Game time. This is an awesome game. You should play. Someday, maybe soon too. 
I really like this soundtrack to listen to hear every note that comes up. All right. Yeah, I almost forgot to mention that the way they did this title screen in the US, they did a much zoomed in version of the actual image. That's why this looks so pixelated and like a JPEG. Because for whatever reason, Squaresoft America thought, hey, let's get closer to the team rather than give you the whole awesome, cool looking monetary. Yeah, that worked out great. So, as much as I love that intro, you kind of came to watch me play a game. And I magically drool because, well, shoot and spit while well, speaking happens. Oh, I kind of went ahead on my own for my own playthrough because I freaking love this game. I'm going to play this even if I'm not streaming it. It's freaking awesome. I love it. It's my childhood favorite. You already know that. Ah, back to the frosty forest. Is this too loud? Let me know if it's too loud. Eh, give me a sec. I need to make an adjustment. Eh, come on, desktop. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Do it. Do it to it. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry, that was the sandwich that I had just before I started the stream. I was hungry. I needed to eat because I had been driving for most of the day for errands for a roommate. Good old Cinnamini. Cinnamon bun. Cinnamon bun. Cinnamini. All right. Okay, that's a bit better. All right. So where we last left off, we were in the frosty forest. About to go to the Ice Palace, or castle, whatever you want to call it. Oh, Mecca, I'm sorry that it was a short visit, but I hope you enjoyed your stay. Have a good night, sleep well, sweet dreams. Thank you for watching for the short time that you did. Okay. I'm a little bit behind because I get used to my other file, so I need to just catch up with where I'm at. All right. Now let me check that I leveled up things. Okay, yeah, I, I leveled everything up. That's good. So, what I kind of do sometimes in between these streams is level up the magic because grinding, you don't always want to watch grinding. It's a grind. But, it's a nice payoff when you get the grind going. Oh, it's your morning. Good morning, Mecca. <laughs> Let's just knock out this uh, turtle I forgot the name of. Shell Blast. That's a badass name for a turtle. Shell Blast. Going to kick your ass with a Shell Blast. Oh, never mind. I kicked his ass. So. I was wanting to talk- Ah, I got distracted because I was wanting to think of something. Ah, crap. Right. I was wanting to talk about the, uh, apparent response. holy crap, nice hit. I was wanting to talk about the mixed response to a lot of the trailers and whatnot for the Secret of Mana 3D remake. I mean, ah, come on. With Secret of Mana, the 3D remake, apparently they're using the 3D engine that they used for the Mana mobile games. Because the Mana series had a couple of mobile games, and it uses apparently the engine that will be used for Secret of Mana. And people keep kind of forgetting, this doesn't, it doesn't look all the high detail like a nice Kingdom Hearts game. But I believe that's because they were going with the initial engine of putting it on the Vita. And yes, I would love to have seen the game on, like, triple-A level. Because this, to me, is a triple-A game. But I'm willing to accept and go with whatever I receive. Because I try to be pretty open when it comes to games. I want to play games to enjoy them. I don't just play it to be a critic. I mean, I might be a critic on occasion, yeah. Everyone's a critic. 
That's why some people are so critical. But really... Oops, I missed. Um, right. Now we're, oh, I got frostied. Anyways. When it comes to games, I don't truly care about graphics being the beat-all, end-all of the game. I mean, yeah, the 3D remake for Secret of Mana, you don't have lip-syncing, but in PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2, we didn't always have lip-syncing. You had blah, 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 blah. Now, if you wanted blah, 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 with a single two-frame mouth flap, fine, that's okay. But... Sometimes there's going to be games in different languages, so as much as they could put the effort to get all of the lip syncing, they don't have to, and it's not a deal breaker for me. It might seem a little lower end, but you know what? I play games to play games. A game is a game. If it's playable, I'll play it. If it's unanimously, unanimously disliked, I might not go for it. I agree. I agree that if a game is bad, and it's agreed by everyone that it's bad, I might just play it just to like, check it out, but if it's really that bad, I won't I won't play it. But there's such a negative response, I, well not negative, mixed, I was trying to say mixed, I need to stay on mixed, not negative. The mixed response, I can understand, it's not for everyone, but yeah, you're kind of playing with P a PS4 and an Xbox One X. And a PC that can fucking handle everything. Yeah, it's great. You can have all the games that can make you lose your mind because the graphics are awesome. And the voice acting is great, too. Yeah, you can have that, but... Can you just sometimes play a game to play a game? I mean, from what I've been hearing, Secret of Mana Remake, their voice acting is a little bit cheesy. But you kind of know this game itself is cheesy to begin with. It's an RPG. It's a JRPG. JRPGs have that certain amount of cheese that everyone loves. But there was also a new trailer uh, from uh, one digital media meetup um, where they showed more gameplay for Secret of Mono 3D Remake. What I found out is there's more content. So that'll mean there's more development that was probably missing from this. And speaking of missing content, I found out for sure that the amount cut for the story was 40%. For the graphic content, it was 60% when they cut off the CD add-on for the Super Nintendo. So, there's hope for there being some, at least some, of the cut content in the remake. Also, pardon me if I'm sounding like an announcer. This is how I work to make myself speak better. If I speak energetically, I don't always trip over my words. Because this to me is like a character voice. I can do character voices almost perfectly. But when it's me talking, I just go like, uh, uh, trip, trip. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I can't speak. What are you talking about? What is English? Is that what Americans say? No, Americans say American. Because we have slang and stolen words from everybody. America, home of the brave and home of the free usage. Pardon me as I knock out these blue drops. I need to smack them around a little bit. But yeah, and a morph for strike as you are known on the bug. Oh, whoops. This is what happens when I look over. I t I'm, I'm a guy who p focuses more on gameplay. I, oh, damn it, again. Yeah, they combo freaking freezing. Stop running to me, you stinging blue drop! Get away from me! No! Ah, oh, you! Whoa, I died! I should have paid attention to my health! Well, good thing, I got magic powered up! Eh, uh, whoops. Not what I wanted to do! Ah, uh, no, stop! Ah, uh, there we go. Oh, and I got frosty as soon as I changed. Uh, as far as name changes, I am not sure if that is possible because I think they're one of those Twitch is one of those sites where they'll make you keep a name unless they have a service where you can change it. That would be nice. But when it comes to games, strike. I'm a gameplay guy. I'm not a graphics guy. This game, yeah, it's got excellent sprite work, and some of people might not like the low poly 
models of the Secret of Mana remake, that's fine. Everyone is their own of their own preference for what they consider good art. Good art to me won't be good art to someone else. Or it might be, but getting freaking frozen like a freaking frosty freaking fart flying snowman. Yeah, talking is really killing me. Literally. But I want to be oh, engaging and I spat on my screen. Pardon me. Music is so good in this game. They're using the same soundtrack in the remake. I hope that you do enjoy it because it is still freaking fun. And this music is great to play with in this kind of manner. Even in a stream, it's fun. So fun. Yeah. Nailing that music. I like to sing because, well, isn't a voice actor someone who also sings? God damn it! You know what? Sk Kill him, Prim and Popeye! I can't do it on my own! Oh, f f oh, and I was gonna be using Popeye to cast some magic! You know, they don't run out of regens like this, and they always multiply! Okay, screw it! Salamando, let's go! Alright, time to spam it away. Son of a bitch. Kick his ass! Fuck you! Come on! Oh! Well, at least we're skilling up our weapons. Well, this is an appropriate way to grind because they always multiply. And thank God for the three enemy limit. Oh. You know what? I'm gonna wait until he friggin' multiplies. And cast freaking fireball again. Well, that would have been more hand. Oh, really? 200 something damage and it didn't work? Finally! Yeah! Anyways, pardon me. I try not to belch in your ears. I mean, I'm not gonna be the most professional guy. I'm gonna try and be as casual as freaking possible. Try not to be too vulgar with language, because even though they're just words, not everyone wants to hear someone saying shit 20 times in a row. Unless it's funny. Okay, let's try this. Ow, damn. Oh, I should heal. Prim, get some magic in here. I need some cure water. Come on, Prim! Make with the magic! Make the magic! There it is! Much better. Always pay attention to your HP. And that's something else I want to make note of, is that I saw they're going with a... A bar. Literally a bar. You know, like, just... Like a green bar of health. Oh, crap. So, they're not exactly- they might not include the numbers anymore. And then, I kinda like the numbers. It has a little bit technical on the RPG side, but... I liked it. It was nice. I mean, I'm gonna play a game for its gameplay. And story. <laughs> oh, fuck you. Like, right there. That's an appropriate time for me to just- be annoyed at this little blue drop stinking mother. I was out of the way. Ooh. Yeah, good luck with that multiplication because you have a third over there. Haha. -ha. I did see a little bit of the art for Luca, and she looks freaking awesome looking. 
I mean, yeah, you might not like the 3D art, but the art art, you probably will like by default, because everyone loves nice detailed artwork. Oh. Hey! I forgot. I think these guys are allergic. Or weak. Or afraid. Of Lumina. That's something else I might miss, is these ghosts and their appearance. MP, XP, GP. Yep, Lumina. Ah, let me get to the door, I'm right there! Oh god. Hey, that, this is a bug I almost forgot to mention. Sometimes when magic is cast, and you leave, like, halfway through the spell, the light difference kind of gets stuck in the next area. But since we went through this way, I want to try the other way. Okay, this the way to reset this is by casting another spell. Oh my god, that's bright. Uh, let's see if this works. Uh, you know what? I'll just use Undyne's uh, Freeze to redo this. Yeah, it would have been nice if they actually cast appropriately. Ah, crap. I'm trying to restore this. It ain't working. There we go. That's better. Hey, leveled up. So, I want to get over to the other door. I can reach. Ah, let me get it. There we go. This one... I think leads to a dead end, but I like to explore because this is an explorer's game. An explorative RPG because you get rewarded when you explore most of the time. Unless there are empty rooms, which you do get in this game too because they could- Oh hey! Couple wishes! I don't have to buy another one! Hey, see? Reward! It's an orb! We can power up our glove! Oh shit. Alright. So, if you guys ain't doing nothing, you can also feel free to share the stream. I did make a post on Tumblr that you can share if you so choose, and please reblog if you can. Because we need to make the hive thrive! Join the bug hive. I'm winking a lot, but that's because I want to add expressions. I don't want to just be a talking mouth. Hey! You're a jerk! Freaking cloud. Clouds are butts. Ow! I got shell blasted. I am curious, again, to see how the Frosty Forest will look in 3D. It might not have the whole prismatic look that... It did, but, you know what, I'm open to different art styles, especially variations. Oh, speaking of variations and different games, if you ever do want to suggest a game, I have a specific channel for game suggestions in the Hive, so that you can say, hey, I want Jester, or the Doctor, or Flowey, or some other character to play so-and-so game. I have a list. And you can see what I'm playing, what needs to be finished, and what will be played in the near future. So, a lot of that I've integrated into Discord. I've also included, um, there's a couple lists. Games to be played, oh, and games to be uploaded. I have the list of the streams, at least the titles, or the games that were played, listed in the server so you know what's coming up sooner or later. But I hadn't been able to upload much the past week because, well, I was busy and wasn't really in the feeling to upload on YouTube. But Twitch, I don't know. I like Twitch more than YouTube, in my opinion. Twitch is a lot more friendly, I believe, when it comes to content. And right now, YouTubers are fighting the crap out of YouTube to be supported and properly supported. Yeah, supported. An example being that Rhythm has talked to me about. 
Oh my god! Combo! Combo combo! Wombo combo! Content create- Oh my god! Ugh. Use fire! Screw it! Now I spat on my pop screen. Anyways. Content creators are currently fighting for proper support for monetization. Because apparently, if you show something a little revealing or it might be a little bit vulgar, you don't get monetized, you get demonetized. And the amount of support you, er, ugh, stop saying support. I play support. It's in my freaking vocabulary like a freaking sticky booger. Shit, man. Fuck you! Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck you. Well, shooting blank. Anyways, gamers, gaming YouTubers, they are getting snubbed when it comes to video suggestions. And that's in general a thing for a lot of content creators. If you don't watch your favorite creator consistently, they get knocked out of your suggestions. I made note of that before, but still, it's a thing that's there. Let me knock out these, what are they called again? Mystic books. So, gamers, they are kinda they aren't always listed when you're looking up a game. Me, for example, I'm kind of getting near nothing for my videos, so it kind of kills motivation when you kind of think, okay, you have 3,000 something subscribers, but YouTube's algorithms make you kind of go missing or get unnoticed. I mean, the plain fact that they had to make you forcefully click a bell to get notifications, that to me is dumb. Because when someone makes content, you would want to be updated. Not just forced to go click a little bell because you already hit subscribe. But no, you're not subscribed enough. You need to click a freaking bell to get your freaking content. So, I mean, yeah, it might be nice if you don't want to get some content. But by default, you can make it a default. I mean, damn. Okay, killed all the mystic books. Now we move onward. Or downward. Hey, remember these guys? Don't worry, they don't do much until they transform. Tonpole. That's what they're called. Well, the convenient thing is, this guy to the left, you kind of notice he stays there the whole time. These two... They bounce around and they attack. So you can easily knock out these two guys before you go on to the third er, third guy, assuming your AI doesn't want to kill him. Oh, random thought. I remembered seeing a comment in regards to Prim's ponytail being too big. Yeah, what? That was like a freaking square away, that's bullcrap. Why? Why are you boring me? Oh, for fuck's sake! Attack, please! Oh, for fuck you! Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck you! Holy shit. I'm just gonna get a chocolate because I don't need to... Waste cure water unless it's for everyone. Yeah, rhythm, that's what I'm saying. The fact you aren't automatically updated if you're subscribed to someone is the dumbest freaking thing. Fuck you, you stupid freaking thing, you freaking lizard. Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh, great, I'm stuck. I am literally stuck. 
Well, that's nice. I glitched. That's great. Glitches exist. This is a thing I almost forgot to mention. Sometimes you can get glitched into a spot where you can't move. Yep. How can I reach? Oh, this is gonna be a problem. Yeah, just wait while I hit ya. Or kinda hit ya. Yeah. He stays there the whole freaking time. Dance and dance and dance and dance. I try to lighten up my F bombs. By making them little smoky F bombs. Yep, let's just casually do this. Knock him out. Oh, come on. Randy's losing his shit over there, I see. Oh, screw it, I'm charging. Yeah, let's do this. Yeah, just you just wait there while I kill ya. Just yeah. Oh please. Oh thank God. Hey, we were able to get out of the glitch. Yay! Oh great, blue drops. Frickin' blue drops. Frickin' pain in my ass. I'll just casually smack you with my sword. My claymore. That is more than clay. It kicks your ass! Oh, hey, Prim, I need your whip. Hey, hey, hey. Having some crazy good times over here, I tell you what. <laughs> Gotta love this part of the song. Alright, let's get your level for your weapon up so you can charge it to level two. You know what? You're not gonna hurt him by. You're not gonna hurt those guys. Oh. Well, that. I just knocked out a cloud. Great. Yeah, three enemies at a time on the screen. Otherwise, they disappear. So, on the note of the schedule, if you guys are liking these new hours, I will stick to these hours and make this a night owl stream, but like early evening, considering it's evening for me. Like six to six. Wait a second. Four to seven. Four, five, six, seven. Six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. I'll be going until nine. I was losing. I was losing track of my math. I don't know why. Okay, let's go through the necromancy portal. So, I will be streaming six to. Oops. Six to nine at this time but it might go to like five to eight for the next week oh crap I've been moogled moogles are like mogs and those other moogles in the Final Fantasy series oh that's an attack one I am really hating these ding-dongs Hey, got him! Loosen beam. Damn it! What the fuck? Ugh. Ah, shit, I did it again! Screw it! Going through the door! Oh, hey, boss time. Be gone, foolish mortals. 
Scary. Let's go! Very wise, my children. Oh! Now go. Oh, yeah, I can check this out. Oh, let's go, as and let's leave. Not what I meant to do. Although, I probably should have used that as an opportunity to heal. No way, man. This is the 90s. Of course I say no way, man. Quite conceited for a child. It's time for your punishment. Alright. Time for some heals. You know what? No, wait a second. I need to analyze. Ah! Uh -huh. I got you distracted. Oh, crap. Salamando! Alright, let's get some health in here. And you! Cast that fire! Booyah. Yeah, when you level up your uh, magic, it's kinda broken. Alright, you're out of MP. Almost. Alright, did you get hit or not? I guess not. Acid Storm! For fuck's sake, could it disappear in so I can bloody frickin' hit ya? Ooh. Let me cast it, damn it. There we go. Jerk bag. Yeah, I haven't really subscribed to anyone recently myself on YouTube. But I don't really follow too many people. I'm more of a creator than an observer. I mean, I'll observe and learn. And I'll pick up some tricks. But when it comes to content, I try to be more of a creator than an observer. So I don't follow too many people, but I do kind of go from page to page, video to video, just like watching them as little one-offs. But, I mean, at least on Twitch, when you subscribe, it automatically makes you say, Hey! Do you want to get emailed? Ah-ha-ha-ha-ha! Oh! Friggin' Frost Gygus. Here, I shall cast through a muffled amount of snow. <laughs> you see, magic is a little bit broken in this game if you level it up. Yeah, but I could just take the more difficult route and go physical. But being a glass cannon makes you a lot more powerful. Way to go! Got. Um. Wasn't there supposed to be something to happen? Um. Did I just glitch? I think I glitched. Well, that's nice. We have to go through this again! Oh, jeez, you gotta be kidding me. It was the magic that killed it, didn't it? You know, I should have done a save state. Oh, freaking well. Well, time to rush. Well, time to reset. Thanks for freaking screwing me over, Frost Gygus. Yeah, restart. God damn it. <sighs> All right. Let's try this again. Alright, excuse me. Coming through. I'm trying to get to the ice palace here, sir. As broken as magic is, it also breaks the game too. Yeah, these are the trees I'm talking about. They look so awesome. I love pixel work, but I'm, again, open to different art style. Graphics won't be the end of a game for me. They're just flavor. 
All righty. And on the note of subscribing on YouTube, I'm subscribed to different people, but even then, I don't get good notifications. I get recommended and random uploads. I don't get a consistent upload uh, schedule. I don't get an, a consistent like series of videos unless I go directly to the page of the creator. You know what? Skip these dudes. We're going. Oh, frick. I got hell friggin' help shout blasted. God damn. Yeah, YouTube's a great place to succeed if you manage to get through all the frickin' algorithms and bad user interface. Bitch. Oh, you are a dick! Oi! Grievances I have is that you cannot defend unless it's random. Because otherwise, it's just hit and run. Goddamn dick. Alright. Uh, was it left or right? I think it was left. I swear, it's always left with me. Hard mix goes. Oh, you bitch! I hate blue drops. Alright. Let's get some magic in here. Oh! Now I need to go right because there's the orb. You know what? I'm not gonna waste the magic. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's hurry on over, let's speed through all these dudes. Even though it's not an actual speed run, but you know what I mean. Alright, give me that orb. Good God. I swear to God. God damn it. Oh, you're a dick. You're a dick. Bitch. Shit on you. I need to charge my weapon. Never mind. Oh, god damn it, I keep running into it! <sighs> oh, hey, let's see what's in the chest. <coughs> Chocolate won't fit? Why not? Oh, wrong one. Skip the ghosts, skip the specters. Are they called specters? Let me see. I need to see. Spectre, yep. They're a spectre, I'm a jester. Totally different. Hey, there we go. Yep. Oh, fudge you. Oh, never mind. I don't have to charge up after all. whistle that low at the moment. Let's knock out this frickin' mystical book! Frickin' clown ghosts stinking casting phrase. Yeah, let's just cast all. Bibbly bobbly booyah! Through the maze! Yeah, don't go up there, that's a dead end. You gotta know to sneak past this shelf unit over here.
Well, he's dead. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Stop getting hit. Yeah, let's kind of skip past these books real quick. This is turning into a glitch stream more than anything else. All right, let's try this again. Get to these ton poles. Yay. I love repetition. You just gotta do it over. All right, let's try this again. You know what, I wanna see what they fear. God dang fighting lizard. Uh oh. What the hell? Oh, what the hell? Oh, Salamando! Bitch! Okay, let's try this. Oh, of course they'd fear Salamando. They were in Undyne's cave. Oh god, I'm frozen. Not this again! Not this again! Haha! You cast it three ways! I got split three ways! Haha! You cannot survive! You will be dead! Now you die! Stop casting fucking cure water! Now die! <laughs> By the way, do you like my neck beard? It's a neck beard because I have Native American blood which prevents a good portion of my facial hair from growing. Holy shit. Not gonna die here. Not gonna die to a bunch of freaking gooey blue drops. Speaking of casting magic three ways, let's get some cure. Water. All right, how you die? Come on, let's make it quick. Not so painless. Oh, come, oh, what the fuck you doing? Stop trying to hit the gas. You can't kick the ass of a gas, because they have no ass. Okay. Oh, wait, Blue Drop's not here. That's good. I can skip past it. All right, skip past you two. All right, back where we left off. Be gone, foolish mortals. No way. Come! Okie dokie. Bye bye, it's your time to shine. Oop, too soon. Now to friggin' combo him. Combo him like he comboed me, jerk. Oh, dick. Did it cost? No, it didn't. That's what I like. It doesn't cost you if it doesn't cast. Let's do this. All right, one more shot should do it. Literally. <laughs> okay, now it should be okay. 
Way to go! Got Boomerang's orb. There we go. Hey, it's Santa! <laughs> and you are? No way! Isn't he? Oh, Master! Santa Claus! Are you alright, sir? Oh, Rudolph! Sorry to have worried you. It seems I'm fine now. I turned into Frost Geigers because kids just no longer believed in me or Christmas anymore. When mana fades, kids start to lose their hopes and dreams. I wanted so badly to bring back all of their dreams. But then I heard from someone that mana seeds grow instantly into enormous trees. I set off to find a mana seed, thinking I could grow it into a huge Christmas tree. But the seed amplified my worries and fears, and turned me into that monster. If the power of mana instant handled, isn't handled with care, it can be very dangerous. Here, take the fire seed. You need it, right? Consider it an early Christmas gift. Thank you, Santa. Got the fire seed. Now let's go to the fire palace. Wow, this is great. So, what am I getting for Christmas this year, Santa? Ho, ho, ho. I heard you were causing mischief. World famous exhibit hut. Hmm? Ah, oh, man. He really does know who's naughty or nice. Anyway, we'd better get the seed back to the fire palace right away. That's the ice palace. Now to go back to town and make our way. Oh God. Make our way towards the fire palace. Son of a bitch. Oh jeez. Oh, bitch! I am going to slap you so hard, you will not wish you were so sad so hard! There we go. Double kill. What the fuck? Oh, okay, never mind. Okay. Anyways, what's new with you guys? I wanted to allow you guys time to speak too. I mean, I don't always have content to talk about, but that's just because, I don't know, I'm just a guy who goes on the, off the cuff. I go by the seat of my pants. Ah, blockage. By crystals. Convenient walls. At least they're not invisible walls. Looking at you, Risen Evil. An alien and every other 3D game that has invisible walls. Ah, time to heal. There we go. Yeah. Oh shit. Ah, it's getting so frosty out here. It's a little cold. Yeah, I've known the feeling of not having a lot of time to do stuff. I have a full-time job. And while I could be doing more in between, I kind of want to still have a chance to relax a little bit. But, yeah. It's always fun to be had in having a schedule. I mean, schedules give you a little bit of order in life, but sometimes they're busy and that's not always fun. I like the ability to also breathe now and then. Oh my god. Oh shit. Freaking attack spam. Couple wishes won't fit. Well, of course it won't, because I didn't die this time. Going down. Oh hey, here's the oasis. Quote unquote, the oasis. Yeah, my only free time to do stuff is these three days of the week. Monday through Wednesday. That might change to Oh, hey! Is that a mana beast? That is a mana beast. Or dragon. I didn't think I'd see one of those here. Oh, 
Well, it's gone now. Freaking monsters. But yeah, my schedule might change with work depending on how things go. I might be working a 312 schedule instead of my 410 schedule. Is this the cannon travel? Nope, that's just another area. Ah, damn, kicked me right from your butt. It seems like a lot of hours, but with the job I'm currently working, it, I'm active during it, so it doesn't feel as long as it actually is. It kind of goes by relatively fast. Which is a good rare thing to find when it comes to a job. Oh, there's cannon travel. But if I work 312s, that means four days off. But I only get like two hours of break time, like after I work, before I have to go to bed and then wake up again. Let me see, let me read. Cannon Travel Center! If I, well, like, no, if I, when my online stuff takes off, that'll be my full-time job. For right now, online content has to take a part-time position because, well, full-time pays a bit more right now. Just slide into the cannon! Oh, yes. Slide right into that cannon. And you will not hurt one bit. You will fly across the sky. Miles. Well, not miles. Maybe a mile in the air. But you will be okay. You will land mostly unharmed. <laughs> ah, Kakara. Kakarot. Good to see you again, Kakara. West. I need to go west. That's not west. I could have sworn it was east for whatever reason. Yeah, that might be a little repetitious on all my content stuff, but I really believe in myself being able to... Ah, come on! Oh boy. Get away from behind the shell-shaped somethings. I really want to be a creator and always do it as my life and living. But the only thing I've noticed that may not be favorable is getting private insurance. Because when you have jobs, you get benefits provided at a small cut to your paycheck. I mean, that'd actually be a good idea for people like on YouTube and Twitch. If you're making enough and you're a high enough level, you can get benefits. For being a creator. I mean, you make the money for it, you can afford it. Pardon me. There's a spider here. Spider legs. Kaboom. There we go. Oh, crap. Boomerang and glove. Okay, we don't really use those weapons that much. Oh god! Freaking Earth slide me! How dare you, dude! How freaking dare you! You freaking ding dong doodle! You freaking ding dong! Hey! Hey! No! Why you gotta do me like that? Why you gotta do me like that? Why you gotta do a brother like that? Oh, hey, you leveled up there, po boy. Why you got- Oh, shh! I was trying to go up. Friggin' sneak attack me. Yeah, take it! Friggin' what jam again? What he called again, I don't remember. 
Robin Foot. Now this room, I think, is a dead end. Yep, it's a dead end. For now. Haha! You are aiming the wrong way! Ho 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 ho! Okie dokie, time to slap you. Oh, never mind. Hey, get over here. I might not be Scorpion, but you gotta get over here. Wow, talk about flames and a line. All right. Oops, that's not the right one. That's the wrong ally. Salamando's magic will work. Uh, I think you're the one. Oops, wrong one. Uh, what I use? I'll use fireball. Does it work? It should. Oh, you're really killing me, buddy. All right, let's try Lava Wave, considering we're in a lava area. Oh yeah, he leveled it up, so it has a better animation. You are a bitch. You are waking me, making me waste magic. Salamando's work, magical work, my fucking ass. We blew the fire out! Oh, damn, that had to hurt. Burned! Literally! <laughs> Look, a dead end. I'm guessing that you fear the cold touch of Undyne. Yep, Undyne. Or it could be Undine. I don't know. Let's try this again. And... Aha! Hey, get over here. I got you. Chocolate won't fit. Chocolate won't fit. Okay, there's the entrance. Oh, great. Oh, great. I'm on fire. I'm engulfed. Oh, you are a bitch. Okay, gonna do okay. You know what? You know what? You know what? That. Alright, before we go up, let's go down. Because there's a chest. It is 1,000 GP. And this is a dead end because, well, cut content. <laughs> you are dead! You are no longer al Oh, shit. Far! Stop engulfing me! Time to power the sword up. Two, three, four. That doesn't do shit. Come on, come on. Oh, you bitch. 
You bitch. You bitch. Your dick. Good enough. Screw the frickin' red drops. Flame drops. Whatever. Alright. What is that one good for? Hey, Salamando. Are you gonna actually work with me this time? Work. Hey, there we go. Alrighty. Hey, you don't move, buddy. You're not gonna move. You ain't gonna get away from me. Don't even think about it. Don't think about it. Now you're dead. D-E-D -E dead. Let's go through this tunnel and get 1,000 GP! Alright! Now let's see. Anything to see here? Oh, let's go down here. Hey, get over here. I am going to kick you in the butt. On the butt, through the butt, down the butt, up the butt. Wow, I really killed him. <laughs> hey, got Axe's orb. I have plenty of orbs. Aight, aight, aight. Take that. And that. Yeah. Oh, hey, treasure chest. As I pick it up through a wall. Oh, no! Great, now a peeing statue. And pity something. Le pity. Something I don't remember the name of the statue. Come on, let's get a move on. Yeah, I can't. Get... Let me check something. Come on. Okay, so I can't get there at the moment. Okay, that's where I came from. I have to make sure. Come on. You're not gonna kill a cloud. Unless it's with magic. Kaboom. You're really killing me with your charge ups there, buddy. Zzz. This is now an hourly reminder to remind you, if you have beats, you can send beats as little as one beat. And I will accept it and love you forever. You may also subscribe or tip if you do not choose to subscribe. But if you don't want to do that, you can go to the bug hive. And hang out with other buggies. Have a good time, play some games, chat, talk about stuff, you know. Just have general fun. Aha! Uh -huh. Ah, that hurt. Aha! Uh -huh. Dodge like a mother trucker. You know something else I'm wondering about? A lot of these dodge animations are somewhat detailed for sprites. I'm wondering how they're gonna do it with the 3D models. Alright. Oh, hey! It's a chest! Chocolate won't fit. Ugh. That sandwich gave me gas. Frick. Boom, shakalaga. I whipped right through you. Ha 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 ha! Pun intended.
You know, I'm trying to remember a certain pun that I read today. A guy was entering a pun contest and sent in 10. But as far as winning, no pun in 10 did. You know what? You know what? You know what? You are gonna eat this freeze. Yeah, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Gotta step on that switch. Yeah, I'm not exactly explaining a lot, but... I don't know if you really want a huge play-by-play -play when a lot of this is just a matter of exploring and making educated guesses. Okay, it's Undyne. And he's out of magic. Whoops. There we go! And freeze! And drop the mechanism to raise another mechanism with stairs that somehow lead you to another area. Oh, here's a minotaur. Or minotaur, depending on how you pronounce it. I'm not sure the fish knows where a lizard is. Oh, Sylphid. Yeah, Sylphid. Whoops. You're gonna swing? That's not as strong as I thought. Oh, damn. Oh, there we go. Did I just make him miss an earth slide? I glitched through an attack. Ha 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 ha. Oh, he's mad. Oh god, I'm dead! There we go. I should pay attention. Forget it. You're going down, buddy. Yeah. Oh, hey. That was another complaint that some people had, is that the explosions weren't on the enemy. No, they weren't always on the boss. You can see right freaking there. I'm a little heated about the mixed response to the 3D remake. Got Javelin's Orb. Hey, we all reached level 30. The seeds on the stage. Hold up the sword. Let's do it. That way, we can get our magic to level four. Through more grinding. Receive the seeds power. And now, because you might not be sure where to go next, we should probably head back to Kakara. Because they said something about the fire seed too. Come on, po boy. Oh yeah, I can use the magic rope. Magic rope helps you get to the front of palaces and dungeons. Yeah, I love the art of this still. I always love pixel art because I'm a nerd. And you know those little scorpions? You're never going to see them again in this area. Because they were exclusive to Kakara and the desert area, and then only the palace area. But now you're not going to see them anymore, because, I don't know, they just disappear. They just gradually disappear. Let's get back to Kakara. You know, the white stuff on the side, I always thought was like some kind of wool or something. Even though it's probably actually rocks. Get over here, Mallard. 
Oh god. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! Ye. 8 bit, 16, and 32. Let's talk to King Amar. Ah, stuck. You've brought back the fire seed, thank you. But our water still just won't return. I guess this realm really is toast. Literally. Now you might not be sure what to do next. Luckily, this lady right here is nearby. You talk to the townspeople some to see if they say anything different. This one. This lady. Everyone's moving away. I think I'll move to the Empire. Now even cannon travel has a route there. I... If I remember correctly, she said she wants to move to the Empire, but this cannon travel thing wasn't mentioned until you beat the Fire Palace. So, this means... We move on to the Empire. After I visit Watts real quick. I'm about to pass out from this heat. Okay, which one's ready? Haha, -ha, inverted colors. Chakra hand. And the javelin. Low javelin. And the boomerang. Rising sun. And the long bow is now a great bow. That's the only issue I have with gray colored weapons is you never exactly know when they're going to be upgraded until you go to Watts. Especially if you don't remember, if you got an upgrade, that's a problem. But thankfully, you get a notice because right up there, you see that three? Stuff like that. Battle axe. It'll let you know if your weapon can be upgraded. Okie dokie. 62, 62. 59. 56. 56. 56. Let's get you an axe. So, to the Empire we go. Where are you heading off to now? It's your choice. Only 50 GP. Let's go to the Empire. The Evil Empire. It'd be a good idea to keep a low profile within the Empire. Just slide to the cannon. Okay. We continue our quest onward. Hey, it's another cannon travel. Hey, this is a good song. Alright, you know these soldiers? You know the ones that kinda boarded that ship in Kakara? This is the Empire's South Town. Yep. Because it's a north sound, too. Hey, Foxworthy, how you doing? A woman named Mara lives here. She's a real nutcase. I know Amara. Judy knows Amara. He's the boyfriend. A different Mara from this one. Mara always carries around a little box. These days, the Emperor has such bizarre ideas and whims. Seeking peace, he prepares for war. He even has a force of monsters in the castle. Now this is an item place. You want to buy some stuff. Oh, this is the, uh, end portion. Let's save. God forbid anything happens. But hey, there's an upstairs. Oh, this is where our shop guy is. Hey, look at that. A golem ring. It's more powerful. Alright, and I need to check something. I need to make sure. Alright. 
What's my armor look like? Okay, we got the gold. We got the raccoon caps. Yeah, let's buy stuff. 550, 350, 700, so get two of those for both Prim and Popeye. A ruby vest. I get those there. Uh, making sure I have everything. Oh, hey! Yay! Okay. Gotta get one more of those. Whoops. Too far. Alright. I think we're ready to go. I need to change my armor a little bit. Oh, no, that's not for me. Uh, there we go. And there we go. 26. Okay. I'll get to you, Popoy. Damn, this chair's making my butt go numb again. This is my only issue with streams is my chair isn't made for long times, long periods of sitting. So, I'm trying to solve that by having a towel as a cushion, but it's not exactly helping too much. It's helping a little bit, but not enough. But it's a good chair. I don't want to get rid of it. I got it for a good price at Goodwill. Whoops. Oh, that's the right way. Never mind. Let's get some money back. Okay, wrong way. Always make sure to go to your local shop to get the best armor. If you can afford it. All right. Now we rest and restore our HP and MP. You may have noticed over time, the uh, price for staying in an inn gets incrementally more. Time to save. All right. We are stocked and ready. Who is this mysterious dude? Let us see. What does he say? Go away! You don't have any business being here! Sorry, I'm gonna hum to a lot of music, it's good. Southtown's not as big as the Empire's capital, Northtown. What do you say? No loitering! No lollygagging. This is our Mara. Well, Secret of Mana's Mara. Carrying a box. Ha! I know who you really are, Sir Mana Knight! Ack! Discovered! No need to panic. Jim told me you were coming. You see, I am really a Tasnigan spy. So is my husband until he later got... caught. I'm continuing his life's work. Is he dead? Anyway, the Empire has sealed off travel to Northtown with his troops, I'm afraid. Drat, is there any way in to, get, to get into North Town? The only other way is the resistance of secrets to a passage east of here. That's what that is. Ew, I hope they have showers on the other side. Give the guard the secret number. Six, three, four. Three numbers. I don't know what six, three, four means, but we gotta use it. It's our only way to gain entry into North Town.
This is a restricted area. I'll need your security clearance code before you can pass. Yeah, so official about that, aren't you? Yeah, I'm setting up a little bit differently because, well, my butt's a little numb. Six, three, four. Our code is 634. Enter. Down the ladder we go. You see, some RPGs do modern, but I like fantasy modern and secret of modern. It's a nice combination. I hope I'm not stepping through poo. You know, since there's a sewer, you'd assume there's plumbing, but you never see a bathroom in this game. Oh yeah, it's a different fish. It's a dino fish. Um, all right, I got you there. Get you over here. Oh, it's like it frosted, you bitch! Oh. You are gonna get your ass kicked so hard. You're gonna get slapped in the face with a sword. I'm getting higher and higher. I bet you're kind of wondering how high I can go. Well, I have a limit. I just like to practice silly voices because that keeps my range well expanded. And warming up does help the vocal cords. Especially practice. I should do more practice anyways. But these streams are like my only time I can do stuff unless I just randomly sing in the car. All right. As far as what I'm planning for the next week, I might be doing a multiplayer game. Excuse your rhythm. Why you gotta be so rude? Well, I'm not 100% sure in which game. I know Ule from the Bug Hive was wanting to uh, play Left 4 Dead 2. So I might get uh, him and two other people. But I also know uh, a couple other friends who want to do Left 4 Dead 2. Like Skippy, who unfortunately couldn't make it tonight's, to tonight's stream since he had to work from 5 to midnight. Central time. Oh, but it's on 5 my time. Wait. Regardless. When it was 5, it would have been 3 here, so even if he wanted to, he couldn't unfortunately have made it. Who knows? I might figure out something. I might make an alternating thing. I might make an alternating thing. But I'll let you guys know for sure in the next few days what I decide on doing. I just want to be sure I can catch up a little bit. But I also live Secret of Mana, but I've played this two weeks in a row, almost four weeks in a row, except for the one week I played Battle Block Theater with Enzi. Insane, as you may know him as. Yeah, I'm just casually grinding because this is a bit of a slow moment where I talk with you guys. Check how you're doing and let you know what I'm going to do. So, as per suggestion and, I guess, recent demand, Left 4 Dead 2, it is. Yes, Rhythm, it is the Panda Poof. He's also in the Hive, and he's also a roommate. But he doesn't show his face much, except for the time he showed his panda face throwing a Gengar at me when I was playing Spooky's house, of, or sorry, Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion. Thanks, Rhythm and NZ, you couple of butts. Trying to spook me when I'm playing a spooky game. I'm trying to be all spooky about it. Out there. Oh yeah, these fish shoot missiles. I forgot to add that. On the repertoire of silly and crazy attacks, 
That particular fish shoots missiles. Has a range attack. Or torpedoes. It might be torpedoes considering he's a fish. Booyah! Booyah! And booyah! Ha ha ha! You are dead! Not a big surprise! <laughs> yeah. I'm grinding a little bit, but you kinda gotta level up in RPGs to survive. It's part of the experience. Yeah, I love you too, Rhythm. Hey, another grind point. Oh, no you don't. All right, get over here. Haha. -ha. Ha ha. Oh ho. Oh shit. Oh. You know what? You know what? You make my nose itch. My nose freaking itches. That's one of the most annoying things. I'm streaming, and my face decides to randomly itch. It might be for me talking or moving a lot. Who knows? But it's like, all right, I got an itch. I gotta scratch it. I mean, how can you concentrate with an itchy nose? It's impossible. Oh, don't you chase me. You aren't gonna get me. You can't kill me, I am the juggernaut. Hey, hey, Rhythm. I was talking to you about going that direction. Don't you be doing that. So rude. Oh. Hey, the AI killed him. There's supposed to be a running, running water sound effect, but the other sound effects knock the sounds out. Oh, over here. Oh, level 31. Hey! No fun. Oh, crap. Oh, shit. There you go, you got him. Alright. Kick the blue drops. And their non-existent butts. Hey! Hey! Get over here! Get over here! You're... gonna... lose! You blue drop son of a biscuit. You multiplying rabbit tracking stinking stickle picking pickle flipping stingle bingle something gibberish. I don't know. I know about phrasing. I have a bad habit of making interesting phrasing. Well, that happens. It's, 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 it's English. It's got a bunch of double entendres, meanings, puns, plays on words, everything. Language is a silly thing, but it's how we communicate. Oh, shit. Kick their ass, sis. There's only one way to assess this situation. It's by kicking the ass of blue drops. You know, I could skip these dudes, but I don't mind the experience. Oh, you shithead. If I swear enough, this is gonna be a more mature stream. But I did make that setting for a reason. This stream is marked for mature audiences. Because it requires maturity to know responsibility. With words, drinking, drugs, sex, everything. But America's afraid of sex, so we can't talk about sex that much. But on the note of sex, I believe 
that children should progressively get taught sex ed. So God forbid anything bad happens, but also gives them a responsibility to recognize, oh, hey, this is a small thing. I mean, like, young age, discuss birth and how it works. And then, as they get older, towards the more mature ages, talk about safe sex. That way we don't have middle school and high school pregnancies. I remember my high school had a few pregnant ladies. Oh, shit. Friggin' missile killed him. Damn torpedo. You're really killing me here, Prim. For fuck's sake! Prim, get the fuck down from there. I have to control you to get friggin' moving. Okay, what are you afraid of, Dino Fish? Let's find out. You know, Analyzer is the easiest way to level up Sylphid. Well, no exact weakness. Oh yeah, the fun part of these levels is that the enemies also damage you more. Oh, you dick! There it is. And what's down here? Nothing in particular. Hey, blue drop. No way. Oh. Drip, 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 drip. Yeah. You know what? Let's use an exploder. Oh, the sound's gone. Oops, there we go. Honestly though, sex is natural. You just have to be mature. Oh, golden TR, let's sell that later. I mean, I just don't see what the big freaking deal is about being afraid of your own freaking body and making it taboo. Everyone has body parts. It's a part of science! Are you afraid of science, America? Do you fear science, America? Do you fear words? Do you fear facts? Do you fear theories? Tell me, America, what is your fucking deal? I mean, like, fucking in a pun way. Oh, you are a dick! That's the fun thing about this game, is you can push enemies out of the way. Just like the, uh, people. Hey! Treasure chest in the way! Oh boy, get out! Get down from there! Chocolate won't fit. You know what? You know what? Skip it. How convenient these people are here. What the? Who are you people, Imperial Spies? Hardly, I'm Randy. Oh, Jenna told us about you. Welcome to the Resistance. My name is Chrissy. I'm the one in charge of this outfit. I've been hoping to meet you, Sir Randy. Oh, uh, <laughs> it's a real pleasure to meet you, sir, uh, ma'am, Kissy, I mean, Chrissy. Isn't it impolite to go and drool all over someone's floor, Sir Randy? Ooh, she's mad now. Making Prim jealous is dangerous, Randy. Oh, knock it off. I'm Dalek's girl, and don't you forget it. That's where she openly admits that she is in love with Tyluck. If it wasn't apparent from the beginning. Haha! <laughs> Wait, you know someone named Dialuk? Of course, why? A Dialuk has been draining people's energy at the ruins to the northeast recently. Just like in, just like in Pandora. But why would Dialuk... Vampire could have brainwashed him. We need someone to get in there. We'll do what... We'll do it. We've dealt with this type of thing before. Okay, but be careful. 
Chrissy's our leader. Chrissy's dad founded the resistance. When he was caught and then executed by the Empire, she kept our group together. She's only 18, but she's brilliant. Good luck infiltrating the Northeast Ruins. I'm counting on you, Randy. I like her outfit. All the trouble started about 15 years ago, around the same time the Emperor first met Thanatos. Thanatos introduced himself as a traveling magician and offered the Emperor his service and skill. With his advice and magic, the Empire attacked Tasnika and easily crushed the Republic's troops. Nearly invincible, they went on to attack other countries in a bid for worldwide domination. But... <clears throat> but Thanatos and his sorcery failed once near Pandora. The disaster cost them the war. I don't know what happened, but they've both been obsessed with mana and the fortress ever since. Anything else to say? Oh, no. Okay. Can't skip this. Come on. Itchy chin. Hey, you look like the other guy. And the other guy. Chrissy had to grow up too fast. I can't get down there as much as I'd like to. The Emperor's had some powerful and dangerous bodyguards. Sheiks, Geshtar, Thana, and Thanatos. They're capable of anything. The Emperor has ordered his ship to locate us. Tactical Unit 3, please move into position. Mlercy ton yosif, yoif. Now, do you copy? Over. They have walkie-talkies. People sure are busy in the ruins over there. It's fun playing Star Wars. I want a lightsaber to help smash the Empire. Yeah, Star Wars reference. Right frickin' there in your face. Ah, itchy nose. No, not again. The resistance base is well disguised. Hey, kid, you're in the way. I heard Chrissy crying late at night. Yeah, because, you know, taking over in a war at a young age isn't all that good. We fought the Republican once before, and they were no match for the awesome might of the Empire. The Empire consists of this town, South Town, and the Gold Isle. Doing lady voice is a little awkward, but I don't mind. Oh hey, just a little side note. This would have been an entrance to something else, but graphic content got cut and therefore knocked over a portion of this town. Let's go to the shop again. Now here's going to be a random bit of trivia. This tiger bikini and the tiger suit and the tiger cap, these will all be cosmetic items in the 3D remake of Secret of Mana. They are armor already in the game, but I guess cosmetics make, thing look, make things look a little bit different. I'm not sure if any armor is going to actually be cosmetic other than the pre-order suits. So. As you can see, it's more expensive, and therefore more powerful. So, we got some short-term armor, just because. Tiger suit for two of us. And the tiger bikini for Prim. It's more expensive than the tiger suit. I got that, got that already. Time for frosty rings. One. Two. Three. And, um, yeah, I need a couple wishes. The good old couple wishes will bring anyone back from the dead. Unless everyone's dead. Oh, I could have sold the thing. I could have sold that armor. Now let's do that now. Bada boop. 
Bibbity bobbity boopy. Uh, go down. Get that. Get that. And that. Oh, yeah. I got an extra thing. Yeah, that. And that. Making our money back. All right. Well, let's armor up. Ah, wrong way. Hey, that's nice. There it is. Alright, get you your tiger suit and your frosty rings. And your tiger bikini. Which is more powerful, or more defensive, rather. Eh. Pardon me, lady. Ah. Yep. Yeah. No way to the other side. Oh, there, talk to her. Or is my voice drops? Yeah, RPGs, the bikini is always stronger. I mean, that's how it works in most RPGs. And why is my microphone so low? Get up here. Hey, hey, come on. There we go. There we go. That's better. So, let's talk to the townsfolk some more. A little bit. Have you seen my wife around anywhere? She's been acting strange all of a sudden. Talk to that lady. Let's see what's at the inn. And I want to make note that this inn in particular, ha ha ha, has wants for all of your blacksmith needs. Make yourselves at home, young ones. Young travelers. Sorry. I'm used to so many different words. I have a habit of jumbling them all the time. Now let's get some rest. North Town is 20 GP more expensive. There's another portion of that song if you, uh, die completely. All the music in this game is good. A little repetitive on occasion, but still good. That is quite true, the rhythm. Let's go into this building. I'm a seismologist. There aren't too many of us these days, but it's still an important job. The Emperor himself came to me for advice regarding activity around the Southern Coral Reef. I believe something massive is under, hidden under that coral over there. What could it be? Foreshadowing. Now let's go to the other one. You look the same. I'm the local doctor around here. If the Empire keeps this up, I'll never go out of business. All right. Hey, hey, kid. Hey. Kana gave me some candy. I can get more if I go see her at the ruins. And she says nothing. Fana, you know, Prim's friend. We'll find the Resistance base soon. They can't hide forever. Anything of interest over here? You may pass only if you have business at the castle. Hey, it's a family house. We have a big family here. Whoops, wrong voice. Oh, well. Is dinner ready yet, Mom? No, Timmy. Not yet. Why is the Emperor taking on the world? I fear for my family. 
Let's go. There aren't any parties at the castle. My sister's going nuts. Oh dear, I must dress for the castle party soon or I'll be late. Anyone else to say anything up here? No. Oh, I was saying Timmy. I guess it came out like Timmy. The ruins are up here. Here we are again. Hey, it's Fana. Oh, Fana, wake up. Are you okay, Fana? Shut up. Dalek and I are happy here. We just love being together. You liar. Don't you wish. Oh! She got slapped. Oh, Fana. Fana. I didn't mean to. Let's get her to Chrissy's for help. Come on, Prim. Randy, what's up? I'm off in these voices, but I don't do a lot of female voices. Chrissy, we found a friend of ours named Fana. She seems to be, well... Brainwashed, right? That sounds like something Stenatos would do. But no sweat. In most of these cases, it isn't permanent. I'll take her to our doctor. Maybe I should go stay with her, at least until she recovers. Don't worry, I'll take care of her. Go help Dialog. And she accepts. All right, we'll come back as soon as we can. Into the ruins we go. Hey, look. That's another chest to be found. And no chest up here. Here we go again. Let's take this side door. Oh, that leads to nothing. Never mind. Oh, I avoided you like the plague. Hey, look, it's an altar. But for what? You know, sometimes I wanted to explore these rooms and hope that there was something secret. But there wasn't really anything secret, unfortunately. Maybe there will be in the remake. I uh, can't do anything here. Never go through the main door first. There's always things to be found. What are you? A ghoul. Goes and ghouls. If you watch, he does a thriller a little bit. Assuming he doesn't die first. <laughs> Ha ha! Hey, it's an imp. And imp and a grave bat. How impish. Oh, that hurts. Very grave. Wow, nice hit. Ah, screw you, a bunch of you. Yeah, that did a lot of good. You know, have you ever been wondering what the javelin looks like? Ah! It looks like this.
Aha! That is nice. And candy won't fit. Of course it won't. Because we are doing so well. Is this an orb or is it GP? Orb! I think it's a spear. I wasn't looking completely. Uh, nope. Hey, move. Booyah. Ah, oh, damn. You're in the way! I just keep trying to hit the imp. There we go. Hey! I have infinite javelins. No treasure chest. Got it. Nope. To the other side door. Aha. Uh -huh. Ah, hit your nose again. Come on, stop it, nose. Oh, crap. You may notice as you level up magic more, it looks a little more badass. So when you get to like level 4, level 5, it changes appearance. Okay, do I need to heal? Not quite yet. Ah, friggin' Spectre. Nope. Hold on. Scoot. Move. Fudge. Come on, let's go! Oh, wait, there is a treasure chest. What the hell? Got Bo's orb. So let's make a quick trip back to Watts. Right over him. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh my god, I gave you a glowing balloon. Don't you love glitches? Don't you love little bugs? Aha! Uh -huh. I got you. Ho ho ho! There it is. Prim, we need cure water. We need to survive. Let us go. And skip these dudes. Pardon me, I need to get some upgrades. There are going to be a couple of special items that will help moogling. But I'll get to that when we get to it. And now that we actually went through a battle area... Oh wait, there's no enemies out here. There should be. Oh, Watts! I need an upgrade. Sorry. I keep having this habit. Oh, wait, what did he say? This town smells like war! Found any new weapon orbs? The great bow we just got upgraded because we forgot to upgrade it. Well, now be like that. It's a bow of hope. The partisan is now a halberd. Let's see how it looks. 49, 37, 30, 47, 37, 40, 43. And I'll get you the bow of hope again. You deserve a bow. 57, 57, 63, 60. 
Eh, I'll try a battle axe. And just because I have the money to spend, let's quickly make a cheap way to heal and replenish. And save. Yeah. Save the game. Yes. All right. Let's go back to the ruins. And find Dylock. Run! Yep, yeah, still that old school minor lag. Hey, oh boy, your weapon didn't change. Oh well, that'll change soon. Now you can go through the main entrance. Oh shit. Hey, Lucent Beam, how annoying. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, there we go. Hey, you can't do that. You can't do that. Apparently you can. Hey, level up. Aha! Come on, go down! Hey, Popoy got his level up. What do we get? Let us see! Oh god, it's a mimic! Shit! Shit, shit! Shit, shit, shit! These mimics hurt! Oh god. Oh shit. I wasn't expecting a mimic so soon. Get over here. All right. We'll survive slowly but surely. Oh man. And yes, this is the hourly reminder that you may contribute bits, tips, and subs. All accordingly, depending on which links you find below the stream. I have them with my usernames and the icons. So any of those little icons you see down there where you recognize the uh, logo, well, those are the places to go. Got Twitch here, GameWisp, and Patreon. Should you sub, tip, or bit, your name, amount, and messages shall be shown within this stream. Mostly automatically. I say mostly automatically because I can't get an auto add on Patreon and Game Wisp uh, subscribe buggies. I need to add those manually, but Twitch, it gets added automatically. Hey, got a trifecta. RGB. Well, he died fast. And a tip for, ironically saying, a tip. For bits, you need to buy bits in advance if you're on mobile. So if you're watching on mobile and don't have bits, unfortunately you cannot send bits unless you buy them on your PC. And, when you subscribe, you will also get a Discord role, specific to Twitch, Patreon, and GameWisp. Also, you will get the exclusive Jester Smiling Bug. I could show you an example. Oh, Strike actually can show an example. Strike, if you have him a moment, can you please share the subscriber emote? It's a smiling bug you've seen. The one I drew, now in form of a emoticon. Uh, 
Hey, there we go. Chocolate won't fit. Of course. But, just in case he is not available at the moment, let me quickly do this. It goes like ideas. Bada boop. Alright, let's get back to the game. Because the game is where it's at. So yeah, that little icon, that little em em emote. Oh, it's not over yet. Unless you're leaving. It will be done in about 40 minutes. Oh, no, I'm not logging off yet. I was just trying to remind about the tips, subs, and, and bits. Oh, no worries, man. I wasn't sure if you were busy or not. Okay, before we go that door, let's go to this door. Because I think this leads to somewhere. I'll just skip those guys for the moment. Did I go the right way? I hope I didn't go the right way. Yep, I went the right way. Gotta do that homework though, Strike. You can do it! You can succeed! I believe in you! I believe! You will succeed! Oh, damn. Kicking butt. Don't multiply, don't multiply, don't do it, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't think, don't think and do it. Don't think, don't think and do it. Haha, -ha. you missed. Twice. Perhaps even thrice. I'll just casually scoot you over to the exit. There we go. Anything of interest in this meeting room? Sadly, no. You know, I really wish there was more secret stuff in this game. But, it's a little straightforward. Whoa, kill them fast. Oh! Nice try, Robin Foots. Gals and ghouls are here to rule the night with the thriller. And away he goes. Here we are again. And gonna smack you a little bit like this. Slice and dice. Oh, with the good weapons. Oh, hey, level five. The max level weapons can go to is eight for power ups, I think. But there is a ninth orb for a lot of these weapons that you have to get a different way. Hey, imp, move it. Oh, jeez. Come on. I shall get you. There we are. Hey, no, no flying. Damn. I'm gonna kick their asses. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna kill this ghoul, then that imp, and then that Robin Foot, in whatever order I do. All right, made it fast. Yeah. Spikes, but what are they hiding? We shall find out. Oh God. But 
Oh yeah. As a different reminder, this emulator is an alternatively scripted version by the user Fusoya. It was meant to be a more accurate translation for Secret of Mana that was to replace the uh, text character limited version of the script that was originally released with the game. So the script is a bit more full, but there's still a lack of proper character development that could be better. I got you. Hey, we leveled up. Nice. Hey, kicking your ass. Kicking it. Kicking it hard style. Oh, uh, I forgot to add with the bits thing. Is that any bits you send will show your little message going by, like from here over to there. And your bits will go into that glass down below, which is a Muxy glass. Muxy is a bot who keeps track of my stream stats, which are updated in the server in case you're ever curious about how I'm doing on streams. Okay, where do I go? I forget. Alright, down here? No. I have, like, five bots on my server, two of which are for, uh, patrons and wisps. Uh, let's just make this thaw a little quick. Hey, gonna do it. There we go. Ooh, excuse me. Oh, fire, great. Always a good time. You gotta love being engulfed. It burns the body good. The burning means it's working. Get over here. You jerk bag. Oh god, there's an enemy there. I didn't notice. Boop. You hear a distant noise. I wonder if it might have had anything to do with those spikes. Oh. I let go on accident. Excuse me. Follow me. I need to get through. Ah, uh, no. And you gonna try and do it again? You gonna try doing that again? Good freaking luck. Hey, there you are. Mm, get over here. She may die. <laughs> and away. He it doesn't go. Speed up level seven. Yeah, you're gone. Oh, hey, Popoy's spear adjusted. It's now the correct color palette. What do we get? Swords Orb! Hey, I can upgrade my sword, finally. You know, with all these orbs you find, they likely would have been with bosses if the game was in its original form. But I really look forward to seeing what's new in Secret of Mana Remake. So, we saw spikes over here, didn't we? Come on, let's go, let's go! A door appears behind you! Hey, you can't follow me. Here we go again! With the drops. Always with the drops. Hey, good luck with that. Hey. I'm going to cut you down to size. Oh, that did a lot of good. Oh, hey, level two. 
Gonna smack this axe in my hand until it's powered up. Oh, come on! Why, yes! Square Enix is remaking Secret of Mana. It is low poly, like for the PlayStation Vita, but it includes nice, cheesy voice acting, new art, um, more dialogue, apparently. And yeah, it's 3D. But here's hoping that the gameplay stays the same, and I don't really mind what other changes they have. I'm here to play a game, have a good time, and relive the story in a fuller version. But if you look on YouTube, uh, or just on Google, you can find a couple of trailers, well, two or three trailers, depending on what you want to consider a trailer, of Secret of Mana. There's the announcement trailer, and then there's a couple of gameplay trailers. So it goes over a little bit of how the game is, and there's one where it gives a bit more for the dialogue. So, with the announcement of Secret of Mana being remade, that's when I decided to replay my childhood favorite here, and that's when you got this uh, series of streams where I go back through Secret of Mana. But I just remember they call Mana Mana in the m remake. The correct pronunciation, or most often correct pronunciation, is Mana, not Mana. But I'll take it. I mean, it's its own series. It's a series based on mana, or mana. Now, with the announcement... Oh god, double. With the announcement of Seiken of Mana being remade, people didn't probably didn't see the original Seiken. <laughs> yeah, I... Not sure which redneckish state you consider redneckish. But they did remake the first mana game, like, twice. First time it was sort of mana after being Final Fantasy Adventure when it was originally released. And then it was Seiken that was released on the PlayStation Vita. It's a remake, but a better version, and I guess, of sort of mana. But now, after the remake of this Secret of Mana, a lot of fans are hoping for a proper follow-up to Secret of Mana 2, which is Seiken Densetsu 3. This game, right here, is the actual two in the Mana series. So three is what a lot of fans are hoping for because the third game never got properly transitioned over to the West. You know, back when a lot of the Super Nintendo games were Japan only. Or mostly just the Square Enix games, like three Final Fantasy games. Or two. Because Final Fantasy VI was Final Fantasy IV over here. But then it got properly renumbered to Final Fantasy VI when they realized, Oh, America wants it? Okay. So yeah. Similar to the concept of Final Fantasy getting skipped, Secret of Mana 2 was also skipped for the West uh, localization. And swing and miss! Swing for the fences! Okay, so it was a jump of three Final Fantasies. But, as time went on, we got our corrected versions. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Rhythm, no! Well, he's a trucker, he doesn't always have the best signal. Oh, hey, boss time! Your weakness is... Derpy eyes. Which wall is this? Doom's wall. Doom's eye. And you fear? Lumina. Well, let's see about making up for that. Ah. 
Hold on, let me try this. Ah, damn. Po boy, stop vibrating. Why you bugging me there, Animorph? Why you bugging me? Well, that does a lot of good. Oh god, confuse hoops. Come on, we can do it! Hey! Get over here! Ooh. Oh no. Oh, it might be too late. Well, there wasn't any fear, but yeah, let's try a little bit of the gnome. Gem missile? What the? Why? Come on! What the frick? Oh, I guess you're right. Gnome did work a lot better. Thank you for that, the uh, Grokon. Or Graucon. Oh, about the same. Never mind. I guess that was a lucky hit. Hey! And Doom's Wall is no more! Well, I suppose I'm the leader of the buggies, but everyone's a buggy. Yeah, I kind of did more or less the same thing. I've played through this multiple times. But I initially played this game with my dad, and that's one of the fondest memories I have of this game, is playing through this entire game with my dad. He was playing as Randy the whole time, and I played as Prim, which coincidentally was the healer, and I guess essentially a precursor to why I'm always in the healer role for support. Well, heal and defense. Heal, defense, and buff. My fate of being a support person started at a very young age. My dad and I, we loved this game. And of course, I did cry towards the end. You, what do you say? Nothing. But yeah, other than that, I would totally lost track in how many times I've played this game. Oh look, a door. Doesn't open. Well, that means we have to talk to Dialogue here. Dialogue! Prim, at last you've come. Oh, Dialogue, I'm so glad you're safe. I knew you weren't behind this. Oh, and so much for that. Seizure warning, sorry. Hey, just what do you think you're doing? Pesky girl. Bring, bring her back now! Sorry, but Thanatos needs her help. You can't be serious, she loves you! Why, you... Take this! Yeah, swing your axe at him. Ouch! Ugh, Prim. Prim, ugh. Thanks, I needed that. I can't seem to move, so please help Prim for me. Go through the door back there. Hurry before... Before what? We'll find out. Come, Popeye! We shall make our way to save Prim! Prim! Ah! <laughs> Stick around for a while. Her life force is strong. She'll be perfect for. Hey, what the? Idiots! Stop that at once! Yeah, good old tomato. Where am I? You can move? We can too! Gah, Dylock! How dare you defy me by helping them! Who does he think he's toying with? Bah, I grow weary of this. Vampire, take them all out! Random door. Let's see. 
What vampire feels? <laughs> oh, 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 Lumina. Every freaking enemy fears Lumina in this part of the game. But you don't get Lumina until later. Ah, skip it. Let's just use some Sylphid. And... Eh, good enough. Level four, how dare you? Hmm. Oh, God. Damn it. Vampire, get over here. Oh. Ooh. There we go. Aha! You missed. How did you hit her? What the frick? What the fruit fly? Let's do a little more. Okay, that was a little odd. All right, almost there. Get over here! I need to slap you! There we go. Oh, damn! That hurts a little bit. Damn! Again! You know what? Screw it. We're going with magic. Yep. This game had some convenient bugs. I'm not sure if you were here before, but when fighting the three biting lizards in the ice palace. They kept friggin' devouring me, literally, causing me to get stuck in a corner, so I had to switch characters. That's one of the fun things about this, is that sometimes you get stuck on corners and behind walls. Come on, vampire, you're almost dead. I'm curious how Vampire is going to look in the remake, too. I'm curious about everything. Oh, Animorph, you know what I mean. Oh, no problem, dude. Happy for you to join me. What were you streaming there, Grokon? Oh, crap. No! Ah, oh, shit. Come on. Rimworld. I'm not familiar with Rimworld. Unless you mean Skyrim. Yeah. Damn it. There we go. Ah, oh, missed. I missed again. Come on. We can do this. We can do it. We can do it. You can do it. You gotta do it. But I love this game so much I kept playing it on my own a lot, so I got used to being three players at once. Okay. I'll have to look at it sometime. I have a long list of games to play, so I may not get to it right away. Unless there's a high demand for it. Got Boomerang's Orb. Where's Dylock? Dylock! Dylock! Sorry there, Prim. Prim, I. Let's just go. Yay, don't you love sad moments? 
No, I'll be okay. I'll find him. I'm sure of it. Oh, that was a little low voice for Prim. Sorry. <laughs> I have a range, but it's a little limited. Back to the entrance we go. Well, that's it for that little section. Yeah, it was sad because a dialogue was gone again, and Prim has been trying to save him repeatedly. Let's power up our weapons. Well, no one died yet. All right, weapons. Orbs. Rising sun becomes red cleaver. The claymore becomes Excalibur. Oh wait, did I miss one? What? Hold on a second, I need to see. Oh, I did! It was a gray weapon. This chain whip becomes a flail of hope. Got a bow of hope and a flail of hope. A flail isn't exactly a whip, though. All right, oops, too far. There we go, back to the sword for me. 51. 46, 49, 46, 39, 49, 45. Okay. We have all the weapons we need. Ho oh, But I'm a survivor, you see. Oh, I gotta get more fairy walnuts. Whoops. All done. <laughs> I'm not wandering around aimlessly. I've played this game many times. But I don't exactly explain what I'm doing, though. I probably should do that more. Um, okay, yeah, the item shop. We gotta replenish. I mean, I don't want to give you a constant play-by-play -play one. Some of it's just playing the game and experiencing it. But, as a common rule of thumb, you want to talk to the NPCs. Quite often. Be seeing you. Now to sleep and save. Whoops, too far to the right. Oh, well, that's fine. Yeah, we're okay. Hey. Hmm. Yeah, that's the funny thing about this game is that they conveniently wait for you to do stuff. Yeah, this game is a little limited, but it's still fun. Hey, you're back! Good timing! We were just... What's wrong, you guys? We found Dialog, but Fan... but Thanatos. Thanatos left and took Dialog with him. He's been controlled or something. I see. Dialog is... Well, don't give up yet. We know Thantos is up to no good. We'll just have to keep an eye on it, a close watch on him. But anyway, we've just received an invitation from the Emperor to meet him at the castle. He wants to negotiate a truce. Can you believe that? Maybe we should give the Emperor a chance to speak. Surely we've made the Emperor change his mind. 
this could be what we've been waiting for. We have to take the chance. You know, how did you get the invitation if the resistance is hidden? Okay, we'll go. Randy, come with us. After this meeting, your journey may very well be over. You may be right. Okay, we'll come. Woohoo! We'll go on ahead. Oh yeah, sorry, I keep forgetting. Thanatos is tomato. Got it. I never exactly gave him silly nicknames, I just really was into the game. Hey, good job in finishing your homework there, uh, Strike Animorph. Can I go over here? No. Welcome, the Emperor is pa wait, patiently waiting for your presence. Yeah, I memorized a lot of these songs. I've played this game a lot. Welcome, the Emperor. Oh, yeah, you already said that. The Emperor Van Dole. Sorry, a little spoiler, but this game's been out for about 25 years. Nothing there. Nothing there. To your right, please. Yep. Okay, I'll call you Strike there, Animorph. You know what I mean. Huh? I don't think Chrissy has arrived here yet. That's odd. Would you get your mind off Chrissy for now? I love there's a little bit of sass. Yeah, he is right there. Welcome, honored guests. My, what a day to remember. We crushed the resistance and the new Mononite at a stroke. Stay where you are. Blast, it's a trap. Why, yes, it is. <laughs> Always gotta have that evil laugh. It's a part of being evil in an RPG. You gotta have an evil laugh. I should have known better. You can't trust us. You just can't trust the Empire. Chrissy's taking it really hard, though. I feel sorry for her. Let us out of here. You can't hold us like this. We have rights. I demand to see a lawyer. You mean one from Boston Legal? Oh, Emperor Van Dole, it's a slimy, untrustworthy, disgusting son of a... Oh, Father, how could I have allowed this to happen? I'm total disgrace. Okay, same thing. Sometimes they always have more than one thing to say, but not always. Be quiet in there, you worthless rebels! So you want out, huh? Let everyone out. Ha <laughs> ha! Relax, hotshot! Everyone will get a turn. Oh no! Down the pit we go! Again! There's a lot of falling in this game. And you fear what? Oh god, he actually hit. Dancing with fire! You fear? Nothing. That's not a good thing. Oh, damn, that's good. It's like the Mantis Ant. Damn it, I missed. I hate missing so much. Hmm. 
Ah, it's good. I'll charge up. Oh, come on. That was ball. 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 You blacked, you dingleberry. Stop blacking me. Stop battle blocking me. Charge faster. Hey, I killed him. We did good. Yeah. Yeah. Away to go. Got Globs Orb. Okay, I'll go there in a moment. You would think there'd be something secret here, but there's not. Oh, I can't do anything there anymore. Mr. Hoppy! Or whatever his name was. I used to remember his name because I had the instruction book, but I can't remember what that little yellow guy's name is. He's got a face, and he's also got a name. Let me guess, it's an orb? Oh no, it's GP! These guys are called... Embermen. Emberman. Emberman. They'll burn you alive. Oh, like that. But like the drops, they multiply! Like this. They do it a lot more subtly. Hey, error reach level three. Let's get your attack adjusted. Whoops, not the right one. Damn it, lava wave. You know what, I might skip these guys if this keeps going up like this. Hey, 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 oh shit. They always do that. They always get you a status ailment. Freaking burns me up. Well. That's a good thing we can grind here. Hey! There we go. Hey! They're dead. There's a switch there, but it doesn't do anything. I should have known better. You can't just... You can't trust the Empire. Okay, you already said that. Chrissy, where are you? That was incredible! Oh, thank you, Randy. I'll never forget what you've done for us today. The other soldiers have left for reinforcements. Let's split up and get out of here. We'll see these guys again, eventually. Like Sergo from Kakura. You don't see him again until towards the end of the game. A lot of nice, interesting characters you only get like a short glimpse of. And don't see him for like a quarter or a half of the game. Yay. Ah, shit, shouldn't have been pushing. Don't push things that'll put you on fire. Haha, -ha, counter attack. Have at you! Ho ho ho! He got whacked! Ho 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 ho! Hey! 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 There we go! 
And we're good. Armored man. Armored men. Were these the soldiers? Or are these actually monsters? They're monsters. And away he goes. Damn. Oh no, we've been barred inside. Whatever shall we do? I am not sure what we shall do, but we will survive. One way or another. Whoop. 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 That's always a fun sound effect. Haha. -ha. How about you, flailing armored man? Well, that was fast. Let's explore. Because there's always rewards for exploring. Ha ha! Ho ho! Hee hee! Hui hui. Oh, whoops. My alarm's going off. Eh. I have medication I need to take. Hey, see? Two treasure chests. Two treasure chests. And an armored man. Aha! Ho ho! Oh god, one other one appeared. Got whips orb. And got axes orb. You always want to explore everywhere in case you can't go back. That's a hint. Well, we, for now, are going to beat this place, and then I shall save and call it a night. It'll probably be about 9.15, 9.30 when that happens. Well, 9.15, 9.30 uh, Pacific time. Now let's go through the front entrance. Pardon me. And what's your name? No, not you. You! Dark Ninja! Oh god. Take that! I will take my meds soon. It's not like it's a exact moment type of meds. Since it's a... Whatever a term is, it's in my system. An ongoing process. I don't remember the word I'm looking for. I mean, I could take it, take my meds after the stream, which will be relatively soon. Candy won't fit. Now to the left. I want to make sure of something. Oops. Is it just the one way? I think it's a one way thing. Okay, yeah, this is where we were before. Nothing secret over here. Oh. Excuse me, ninja. Pardon me, pardon me. Excuse me. When, I, when those ninjas always cast magic, I always thought they were going like this. Because I never saw what their arms were. I just thought it was always looking like this when they were casting magic. I 
And away we go! Ho 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 ho! Oh look, double doors. Should I go there first? Yeah, it's my only way. Ninjas! Always ninjas! You can't hide that easily. Hey, you leveled up there, po boy. And we'll kick ass. I'm sure of it. That hurt a little bit. Hey! Spirit be gone! Hey! Get over here! It's a switch! For a door! A not so secret switch for a secret door! Oh god! Had to make a running strike, a flying strike to engulf me. That's great. That's a great. That's ex oh god, through the wall. You are a jerk. Take that. How do you like it, huh? Hmm. Why is there no way over there? Uh, this way? No, this way? Maybe. I'm sure we'll figure our way out. So yeah, just casually grind when you're playing this part. Thankfully, Secret of Mana is partially grindy, like I said, but not like an annoying. Oh, yeah, it was the other way. My bad. The bed. This must be the barracks. Series of beds, that is. Oh, why did I say a bed? I'm getting a little bit tired. Ha 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 ha. And down he went. Ho ho ho. Oh, hey, there we go. You can't get me. I am the juggernaut. Come on, fight me! Other way! Ho 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 ho! Oh, shizzle bizzle. Hey, hey, hey! Get out of here! Ow! Damn, that hurt. Ow! Oh. Get over here. Hey! Hey! Don't you run from me! No, you go that way. It knocks you back! Now this is a portal. Like from the haunted forest. What's that thing there on the wall? Over here. It must be a switch or something. I mean, the other side didn't have it. It must have some sort of unique usage. Yeah. Use Dryad's magic when it's not even going to be available till the end of the game. And by hitting that switch, you are now allowed to pass. Oh, God blast you in the butthole. And here we are. Hmm, I guess you're the real thing after all. Give up, Vandal. The other resistant members have already escaped. Sire, one more chance, please, I beg you. Hmm, why not? 
finish them up and come to the other palaces. They want to destroy the seals on the seas. And now I reclaim my honor. Prepare yourselves. We are now atop the castle conveniently. Because for whatever reason, we had to move to the top of the castle. Hey, get over here on this nice backdrop. Oh, blasted. Ha 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 ha. let's see. I don't think... I don't think he has a fear. And... Nope, no fear. Oh boy, that's a nice hit. Oh, he's with the missiles. Oh god, I'm almost dead. Oops, wrong one. Man, I'm tired. I'm losing track of my magic here. Aha. <laughs> yes, these fights are relatively short if you got the right moves and magic. Ha <laughs> Way to go! Yeah! Got Javelin's Orb. Uh-oh. No! I would rather perish than concede defeat to a bunch of undisciplined children. I have my mecha set for self-destruct. I will take you all down from to Hades with me. We're finished. We'll never be able to get out of here in time. You say that now. What's that sound? Now that sound isn't accurate to the original sound effect that's in the Super Nintendo version. The emulator, I think, garbled it a little bit. Hello! That, that's Truffle. We're saved. My, it certainly seems dangerous here. Am I too late? How did you pass it? Let me guess, you want to know how I managed to get here, right? It was flamey. He grew like a weed and started to fly. I didn't know what to do, so I just hopped on. And he flew all the way here. It sounds strange, but I believe he may think you're his parents. I guess he wanted to help you. Here, take this flamey drum. It's one of his favorite toys. Use it anywhere outside a cave or building and he'll come right to you. But enough chit chat, let's get out of here. Take me back to Matango. It's to the southwest. And now we have the white dragon. And now you can see the world. With cardinal directions. Here's Matango. How do you like riding Flamey, everyone? It's really cool! Yeah, but I almost got lost. How can we tell where everything is? Sorry, my phone's vibrating. Whenever you get lost up there, use his special powers to locate your position. All you have to do is press start to see the map or the LR buttons to change modes. You'll find the lofty mountains to the southwest. You'll find Sage Jock meditating up there. Visit me again, okay? You'll always be welcome into my tango. So, we have orbs. We should do something about that. 
Well, I thought you guys already left. Oh, God, I thought you already left. Wrong voice, God damn. Okay, which one's ready? Chakra hand. <laughs> it's that guitar, man, I swear. Heavy glove. Low javelin. Comes a fork of hope. A lot of hopeful items here. The flail of hope becomes a morning star. The battle axe becomes a golden axe. Anything else to upgrade? Nope, not at the moment. 72, 74, 74, 75. I guess you have to use the whip now there, po boy. Two, fifty-two. I'll go with the spear. It's been a while since I've used the spear. All right. Gotta love the dancing shopkeepers and innkeepers. Now to save, because we are towards the end of the stream. I will give you the outro in just a moment. Alright. Save away. Alright. So, you have been watching for the past three hours. I will, of course, do longer streams in the near future when I get my videos uploaded a lot more. But, as far as what's going on next week... I'm going to maybe try and see about doing multiplayer with Love Left 4 Dead 2 with Ule and a couple of other people if you want to join in. I mean, I might have to try and figure out how to make a system that works for alternating. But yeah. Oh, I, we'll figure it out, Grokan. I, I'm sure I'll, we'll find it somewhere. But thank you all very much for watching, tipping, giving bits, subscribing, following, and joining the Bug Hive. If you're not already in the Bug Hive and want to be up to date on what's going on and get a list of games to play, games to be played, suggestions you want to give, and videos to be uploaded, that'll all be almost instantly up to date in this little Discord link up here. But if you want to do a quick click, you can go down below the stream where I have all the links, including my social media and the server, and where, of course, you want to donate if you want to donate. But <clears throat> other than that, I will figure out something if not... Uh, uh, Left 4 Dead 2, we'll figure out something. I'm going to maybe try and see, depending on the schedule for tomorrow, I'll see if I can finally do a Dr. Tuesday stream with as Dr. Hooves. You know, that particular pony that's always causing trouble. Oh, thank you for cheering, Alco. Thank you for the 100 bits. You're awesome. Come on there, stream labels. You're supposed to be working. Now, you guys should be able to show up right down here in the bits. But what for whatever reason, it's not showing. I'll figure that out. I'll figure it out. But Alco, you are awesome. Thank you for cheering. So, other than that, you know where to find me. You can just find me here, or on the server, or on Tumblr, anywhere. Oh, hey, there it is. It works. Oh, 100, cheer 100. Well, I guess that works. Yeah, I have a series of overlays. Because a lot of this here is pulled together to make it set up. I'm trying not to make it too busy and non-invasive, so that's why I try and make sure the game over here, right over there, I make sure you guys get the full screen. Everything else is incorporated around the game, including me. So, I want to thank you for watching all fine good buggies. I shall see you guys next week, if not sometime again this week, with another game. So, thank you for watching. Praise the Spurple. And no matter the time of day, I say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. I shall see you guys next stream, next video, wherever, whatever. Love you guys. Love, 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 love. So, let me get this little outro thing to work.
You know what? I should get a little bit of music in here. Did I include music? Hold on. I want to give you guys a little bit of an outro music because this needs to be a working outro. Wait for it. Wait for it. Uh, where is it? Oh, I'm in the wrong folder. All right. I'm going to give you guys a little bit of music. Ah, hot heat. That's a good classic for my YouTube. Ah, loud. Holy crap. Oh, God. Oh, hey, thanks for the follow there, Graucon. So, you guys can follow me, subscribe to me, tip, whatever. It's your choice. You have free will. But thank you for coming. And you know what? You got to stay awesome. So, yeah. I'm totally professional. The most professional to ever be professional. And if you guys want to still say anything at all, I'll be in the chat right down there. So I'll be saying, hey, how'd you guys like it? Or, what's up? So yeah, thank you for watching. Love ya. See you guys next time. Now, let me get this to work right. <laughs>